Welcome to my channel. This time, I will be teaching you on how to solve for percentage decrease in the volume of water. But before that, let us first have our shout out. Shout out to Isabello Bartolome. Also, to Mung Bean. Thank you for your support. If you wish to be included in my shout out, don't hesitate to comment in any of my videos. Thank you. To show you how to solve for percentage decrease in the volume of water, I will be solving this problem. Water in a hydraulic press, initially at 140 kilopascal absolute, is subjected to a pressure of 116,200 kilopascal absolute. Using bulk modulus of elasticity, denoted by EB, is equal to 2.6 gigapascal. Determine the percentage decrease in the volume of water. The first thing we need to do is to determine our given. First, our first absolute pressure of 140 kilopascal. Next, our second absolute pressure of 116, 200 kilopascal. And, third, our bulk modulus of elasticity of 2.6 gigapascal. What is required in the problem which we are going to solve is the percentage decrease in volume. It is denoted by dv all over v. The unit of measurement is in percentage. We proceed now to our solution. But before that, please support my channel grow by clicking the subscribe button and the notification bell. Thank you. Now, we have bulk modulus of elasticity is equal to negative dp all over the decrease in volume of dv all over v. dp is the symbol for the difference in absolute pressure. From this formula, we have to derive to get the formula for percentage decrease in volume because it's the requirement for the problem. We now have percentage decrease in volume is equal to negative dp or difference in pressure divided by the bulk modulus of elasticity. We already knew our necessary values, so we just simply substitute it to the formula. We now have 116,200 kilopascal minus 140 kilopascal divided by 2.6 gigapascal. The unit gigapascal must be converted to kilopascal using the conversion factor of a gigapascal is equal to 1 million kilopascal. After that, we simply solve it and we now have a final answer of negative 0.0446. The negative sign indicates the decrease in the volume. Now, our final answer must be in percentage, so, we simply multiply it to 100. Finally, we have a percentage decrease in the volume of water of 4.46%. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned for more upcoming videos.